welcoming hundreds of athletes this weekend to the inaugural Masters Indigenous Games. The event includes a mix of contemporary and traditional sports from basketball to tug of war. It's also free to attend. Cultural Ambassador Kim Wheatley is here to tell us all about it as well as Johnny Isaluk. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Good. We're so happy to be here. Thank well, you. Let me come here so I can talk to you both. Tell us a little bit about how this all began because it is an inaugural event. It so is. So why now? It's the first one. Well, why not now? Why not now? Why not now? This is, this is the time of reconciliation. We want to walk that path together, so why not now? Exactly. So how will everything transpire over the next three days, Friday through Sunday, Downsview Park? Yep, yep. It's going to transpire with interactive engagements daily, starting at 11 o'clock in the morning, goes right through to 5 o'clock. We have a short break, and then we have evening entertainment. Okay. There's something for everybody. It's free. It's open to the public. It's at Downsview Park, as you said, and we're encouraging everybody to come. Big powwow on Sunday. Oh, huge powwow on Sunday. Not just big. Huge, huge, huge. We're going to have dancers, we're going to have singers, we're going to have drummers, we're going to have food, we're going to have all kinds of educational opportunities, demonstrations. It's going to be endless. What are some of the events? We mentioned a few. Yes. But I know we left a lot out. Uh, yes and no. I mean, you can go to the website, www.mastersindigenousgames.ca. Okay. You can get a whole lineup there. We have a shuttle running from Downview Station so everybody can oh, get there. But some of the things will be taking place. Uh, Ogichita, that's tomahawk throwing. We've got Johnny Isaluk, Ambassador of the North. We've got Caparera. We've got Aztec dancers. We've got storytelling. We've got face painting. Is there teepee building? There is teepee building. Cool. Here's I, the other amazing thing. Johnny, you're too humble to do this, so I'm going to say <laughs> it for you. You are an actor, athlete, and speaker. You received the Queen's Diamond Jubilee Medal in 2012 for working with children and for the well-being of the community. And you successfully climbed the highest point of the Queen Elizabeth Islands, none of it, and sent a video greeting Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II. You taught students about Inuit culture and the remote part of the Commonwealth in the Canadian High Arctic. My <laughs> gosh, you're amazing. <laughs> yes. You know, just doing what I love. And That's so what are you going to show us and demonstrate today? It's called uh, Inuit High Kick, and it's uh, an agility game. Okay. Because all the games we played are for survival and fun, sure. you know. Basically. So strength, agility, skill, concentration, you have to practice over and over until you get as good as you. <laughs> <laughs> He's going to try it once, then you get to try. Oh, well, yeah. we're going to end up at St. Mike's down the street if that happens. <laughs> we're going to let you do your thing and make sure you get out and enjoy. Ready? Go yes. for it, Johnny. warmed up, I'll say. <laughs> head out this Friday through Sunday, Downsview Park. For more information, just head on over to the website, everybody, mastersindigenousgames.ca, and we'll have the link, breakfasttelevision.ca. Have an amazing time. Thank you so, so much. So good to see you. We hope we'll to see you back. all there. Give it to me. One more time, Johnny. One more time. Ready? One more time. Check out that high kick. <laughs> yes! Yay!